Hey guys, welcome back to PC Building Simulator. We're uh, we're not in the starting workshop anymore. We're back in the Asus ROG workshop, and uh, the game has gotten an update in addition to the last video where we, we we showed the 1.5 update. Now it's on like well, I don't even know if the version actually changed. It's changed 1.5.1. There you go, 1.5.1. Um, so interesting because this this point. 5.1 update has fixed performance from what I can tell it was very laggy in here for me earlier um, and uh, they've changed some of this maybe some of the weirdness with like CPU rankings like in the last video when we built this um, right after the 1.5 update because they added Ryzen 3rd gen they added the Radeon 5700 and 5700 XT but as we are looking through the part rankings in the part ranking app um a lot of like second gen Ryzen processors were beating third gen and like it was just really weird. So I was just looking through this and now number one for CPU is the Ryzen 9 12 core 3900X beating the 9980XE, which that I don't feel like that's right. But I, I, I mean, so I don't know. We'll see. I guess we're going to see if we can pull off a better CPU score with the Ryzen 3900X than we could with the 9980XE. Um, so we've used the 9980XE in a lot of builds. In fact, like, um, let's see, this is the most expensive PC right here. Uh -huh. Yes, 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 yes. I'm really glad that these still work because I got them in storage. But check it out. They cleared this. Like, this is, I put this in here. That's why this is even here. They cleared it. Like, I don't know if that was part of the performance thing, is that they had to get rid of everything. But I had a lot of builds in here that are gone. <laughs> They're all just gone. <laughs> it's okay, though. At least this one's here. I would be so mad if this PC got wiped out. Whatever. It doesn't matter. I, it doesn't matter. I'm mad about it. Well, we'll go ahead and run this. Uh, we'll see what our CPU score is, but we're going to build a new all AMD PC using the 3900X. It's going to be, um, yeah, all AMD build. Part two. We've done one back on Ryzen second gen, and uh, we used a Radeon 7, which technically the Radeon 7 is a little bit above a 5700 XT in performance, um, but we're just going to put a 5700 XT in it anyway. So, as far as case, I don't know. I mean, they haven't added any new cases. I don't know what to do. I mean, sure, we could, you know, team red, find a red case, red theme. I don't know. I don't know what to do. I guess we could use one of the new NZXT cases in red. Um, one of the ones we haven't checked out yet. Like the H400 is not new. I lied. That's not new. The 700i is new. It's actually a very nice case. Let's try that. NZXT, H700i. We're doing a Ryzen 3900X. It's gonna be a beast. We're gonna need a good motherboard to uh, power it. Let's see. There's a kind of a good way to look at good motherboards is honestly by like RAM speed. So these all seem to cap at 34 megahertz. I really like the ROG Strix X470F. So we're gonna use it. It's just pretty. I wish it was their 570 series board, which I talked about in the last video. They did not add 570 series boards, which is a bummer. Um, oh, okay. Why is it showing up? Uh, yes. 12 core, 3900X. Beast. 12 core, 24 thread. Uh, wow. Yeah. Anyway, pretty good. Let's see, storage. We're gonna start with our usual suspects here, our Corsair M.2 drives. We really don't need more than one, but <laughs> we're gonna put two in it. Cause why not? Okay, all right. 3600 megahertz is the max RAM speed, so. Uh, 3600 megahertz is a nice RAM speed for Ryzen 3rd gen. You can definitely go faster, but it is a pretty good speed. Um, you know, it's been a little while since we've used Corsair Vengeance RGB Pro. Let's throw some of that in here. 
Boom, boom, wham, badam, kablam. Okay, great, good stuff. I'm taking these off because they're messing with my look. All right, let's go around back. We'll do a power supply quick. Uh, let's make sure we got plenty of headroom. Thousand, thousand watts seems fair. Thousand watt. Where have you gone? Where have you gone? Hello? Hello? Oh, there you go. Found you. Nope, I gotta unplug this first before I can install this bracket. I'm learning. Slowly. Slowly. I am learning how to build computers. Alright, what do we got? Three case in the front. We could definitely water cool this. I can't take this bracket out in this one. Interesting. I'll top it. Woo! That's cool. Oh, the top film. Yeah, that's cool. Wish my NZXT case did that. That's pretty neat. Hmm. Okay, what would that? Let's see. What if we just did an AIO this time? We don't do many AIOs. I do so many custom loops. We're not going to be able to water cool the GPU, so I'm a little less. I don't really care as much. No? What is what is your conflict? You want this bracket to not be here? You I really wish I didn't have to scroll every time. 360. No? Would go in the front. Okay, we'll take these fans out. Then. Take the fans out, put a 360 AIO from Be Quiet in the front. Throw some case fans up top. Yeah. That's beast. Ooh. I want that. I want that. It looks good. I want it. Okay. And since we got the Be Quiet fans in the front, we might as well match them up top. I know. It's not going to be super flashy. But sometimes, you know, sometimes I think that's a good look. I don't know what taking that bracket. I don't know what you take the bracket out for. Be honest. Quiet. Be quiet. Uh, okay, we're gonna do three one twenties because two one four two one forties looks kind of dumb. Another. One more, sir. Give me one more. Okay. All right. I feel like I need to have them replace this. Gotta go all. We're going all in on Be Quiet on this build. I like Be Quiet's fingers, though. They look Okay, let's... Let's go this. Peace. Are we gonna daisy chain? Are we gonna be good fans? Good. 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 Okay. Great. Wonderful. Alright. Graphics cards. Like I said, 5700 XT. That's what we're going with. And I don't remember if you can do dual cards, can you? No, I don't think, like, I don't think the 5700 XT, no, it does not support Crossfire. It does not support more than one card. Like, that's gone. That's done. Um, you can do Crossfire with the Radeon 7, at least in real life. But I don't remember. I think you can do this game. So, okay. We should be in good shape here. I gotta take off this one. Look. Okay. Cool. Good. Great. Let's get an operating system going. I am really interested to see how this benchmarks. So, okay. Um, there's gonna. What I do? Uh. What? What I do? What? Uh, Clock watch dot timeout. What? Am I dumb? Oh! Oh my gosh, I didn't install. S oh my gosh, I didn't install thermal paste. Whoa, dude. I must be tired. Like, uh, uh, that's. That's embarrassing. That's super embarrassing. Like, it's not like the third. It's not like this is like the first time I've ever played this game, so. It's okay. No big deal. It's kind of like a hilarious blue screen, because it's just like, yeah, clock timeout. It's like, what? What does that mean? Oh, you overheated? Okay, sure. Alright. 
get a few things going here. Uh, okay, I don't know. I don't need open salt. Uh, <laughs> wallpaper. Gotta have it. Okay. We're gonna go in here and we're going to set our RAM speed. So 3600 megahertz. Um, ooh, what am I doing? Oh, that's right. Okay. Now! Touchy. Okay, 3600 megahertz RAM speed. So that's going to be slower than our 9980XC build to the left. But this, none of the, none of the AM, why, why can I not get into BIOS? Wow, this has been, this has been interesting. Please, let me in. Please, please, please. Hold. It's so weird that it's hold. Okay, sorry, I'm dumb. Uh, all right, 3600 megahertz. Cool. We're just going to go with XMP. That's what we had on this one, too. This is stock clock 9980XE, uh, but the RAM is quite a bit faster. It's running at, let's see, let's, let's, let's scroll, let's scroll. 4,200 megahertz. Okay, but the CPU score, 14,135. Nope, that's a GPU. No, nope, that's CPU. Okay, 14,135 CPU score 9980XE. Part ranking says this CPU is faster so um we're gonna find out exactly what that means oh really wanted that to be front filter um please please thank you i guess we'll see uh it's i don't think in real life the 3900x is competing with the 9980xc but the 9980xc is like what like a, it's like a 1200 dollars cpu or something i can't remember it's no, I think it's more than that. It's expensive. Super expensive. So, um, Corsair, Vengeance, RGB Pro, please expand. There you are. 3600 megahertz. Okay. Stock, 3900X. Let's just do a quick temperature test. I just want to see how hot we get. I'm just kind of curious. The When I, when I did the test on the Ryzen 3600, when I built that last computer, um, and we did a temperature test. It was like 25 C, like something crazy. Doesn't even make sense. This is 82 and a half. Yeah, that, that's more of like a realistic, but it is 12 cores. Remember that it's 12 cores packed into a pretty small little die. So, okay, let's go ahead and run 3D Mark and see how we do. Uh, we're just gonna be looking at the CPU score here. So let's go and run that. Okay, so this build with a Ryzen 3900X, 12 core 3900X, and a 5700XT. Total time spike stream score of 9,171. CPU score of 12,885, which is lower than a 9980XE, which is how it should be. It's just funny because, like, it shows it as, like, higher in the part ranking. And I wasn't sure if that meant that it would clock, but I don't know what that number means. What is this number? I don't know. But anyway, um, that's how it does. So we'll have to do some, I think, some Ryzen third gen overclocking soon and see how how much headroom it has compared to some of the other stuff. Um, see where we can move the 5700 XT as well. Um, so yeah, lots to check out. But here is kind of an all AMD build part two. Oh my gosh, I didn't get my color of all the apps I installed, I didn't install lighting. That's embarrassing. We gotta get our, our all red, you know, team red here. I've got like pink going on and what, what's happening? What is, what is this? It's despicable. It's just wrong. Whoa. Uh, okay. All red. Oh geez. Oh geez. All right. Uh, yikes. Yes. What? This, this is weird. Wow, that is a really bad red. Really? That's red? It's so light. Okay, well, it's like pink. All right, well, there you go. That's, that's it. That is the all AMD build part two with a Ryzen 3900X and a RX 5700XT for the GPU. Um, but yeah, there it is. Uh, more to come from the PC Building Simulator 1.5 update. So be sure to stay tuned for that coming up soon. Um, go ahead and subscribe. And thanks so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. 
see ya.